Sometimes when you're working in Excel, the quickest way to create a new document instead of starting from scratch is to open an existing file and make a copy of it. You can click the File tab in Excel 2010, go to Open, get that file, and then come back in here and do Save As. Sometimes though you forget, you're in the middle of doing something else, you forget and you end up doing some damage to the original file. A different way to create a file from an existing one is to go to the New tab, go across in the Templates and click New from Existing. When you click this, you'll be able to select any file and it will open a copy of that file instead of the original. Another way to create a copy of a file is to go to the Recent tab, and if that file was used recently, you can right-click on it and click Open a Copy. And again, it opens a copy. You can see the number at the end of the file name. Then you'll be able to save this file without any potential damage to the original. If you're using Excel 2013, you can go to the File tab, and if you click New, you won't see that same option to create a new file from existing. But they have kept the option for recent files, so if you click Open, you'll see Recent Workbooks here, and you can right-click on one and open a copy. So this is a quick way to open a copy, and it keeps the original file safe. For more Excel tips and tutorials, please visit my Contextures website at www.contextures.com.